On September 1st, 1773, Phyllis Wheatley's poetry anthology, Poems on Various Subjects, Religious and Moral, was published in London. It was the first volume of poetry published by an African-American woman. Because of her status as a slave, Phyllis had been subjected to examination by many of Boston's luminaries, including John Hancock and Governor Thomas Hutchinson, to verify that she had indeed written the 39 poems in the volume herself. Wheatley's poetry brought her widespread fame and resulted in a trip across the Atlantic to attend the publishing of her book. This Day in History brought to you by the Freedom Trail Foundation, partnered with the Massachusetts Teachers Association to bring history to life.